Over the last week, DeepSeek has been making headlines with its impressive capabilities shaking up the AI industry. But now OpenAI has responded with a bold move. On Sunday, the company introduced Deep Research, a new AI agent within ChatGPT. Its name not only hints at its purpose, but also seems like a direct challenge to DeepSeek. But what exactly is Deep Research? How does it work? What are its strengths and limitations? And most importantly, what does this mean for the future of AI? Let's break it all down. OpenAI's choice of the name Deep Research is quite provoking, whether intentional or not. It raises an interesting question. Are these AI-generated reports truly research? And could AI ever replace scientific research as we know it? OpenAI justifies this by stating, the ability to synthesize knowledge is a prerequisite for creating new knowledge. This suggests that deep research is more than just an AI tool. It's a step toward OpenAI's ultimate goal, the development of artificial general intelligence. Now, let's break it down. What is deep research and how was it developed? Unlike previous AI models, deep research isn't just an extension of chat GPT. It's built on a version of the upcoming O3 model optimized specifically for web browsing and data analysis. OpenAI claims that uh, deep research improves on the reasoning capabilities of O1, making it capable of handling complex research tasks that require extensive context, online sources, and real-time data analysis. The AI was trained using end-to-end -end reinforcement learning, meaning it can backtrack, adapt, and react to new information while executing multi-step research tasks. Deep research works similarly to a research assistant. It gathers and synthesizes information from across the web to generate comprehensive reports on a given topic. AI agents like this are designed to complete tasks autonomously with minimal user input. They can process text, images, PDFs, and other formats to build a detailed analysis based on predefined goals. And OpenAI isn't the only company working on this. Google's Gemini AI also has a tool called Deep Research that performs similar functions. So how exactly does Deep Research work? It's powered by the OpenAI O3 model, which has been fine-tuned for advanced web browsing and data interpretation. To use it, users simply select Deep Research in the ChatGPT message composer and enter their query. They can also attach files or spreadsheets to provide additional context. Once the AI starts researching, a sidebar appears displaying a summary of the steps taken and sources used. OpenAI says this process can take anywhere from 5 to 30 minutes depending on the complexity of the research. Once the research is complete, the output is presented as a detailed report within the chat. OpenAI has confirmed that future versions will include embedded images, data visualizations, and other analytic outputs to provide clearer insights. This feature will help users not only understand the findings, but also visualize them more effectively. So, so what exactly can deep research do? In response to a user's prompt, it can generate a report by finding, analyzing, and synthesizing data from multiple sources, including text, images, and PDFs. The reports will also feature graphs, citations, and a structured breakdown of its research methodology. Users can upload their own documents, such as spreadsheets or PDFs, to guide the AI toward more relevant insights. OpenAI claims that deep research excels at finding difficult to locate information, such as specific scenes from TV shows, niche market trends, um, or historical data buried deep within the web. According to Kevin Wheel, OpenAI's chief product officer, Deep research can handle research tasks that would take a human anywhere from 30 minutes to 30 days. However, like all AI models, it's not perfect. OpenAI has acknowledged that deep research can still make mistakes. One of its major limitations is its inability to reliably distinguish authoritative sources from rumors. This means that while it can provide comprehensive research, users should always fact check its findings. Another issue is that the model struggles with confidence calibration, meaning it might present uncertain information with unwarranted confidence. In terms of availability, deep research is currently exclusive to ChatGPT's pro tier subscribers, which costs $200 per month. Users must select the Deep Research tab before entering their prompts. The AI will then run its research process in the background, notifying the user once it's complete. However, the tool is not yet available in the UK or the European Union due to regulatory concerns.
And now let's see how does it perform in benchmark tests. OpenAI claims that the optimized O3 model behind deep research has achieved a record 26.6% accuracy in humanity's last exam. A benchmark designed to test AI performance on expert level questions across multiple disciplines. Compared to OpenAI 01, the most significant improvements were seen in chemistry, humanities, social sciences, and mathematics. The O3 model also topped another test which evaluates AI models on reasoning, multimodal fluency, web browsing, and tool usage. Looking ahead, OpenAI has big plans for deep research. Future updates will introduce more visual elements, improve data processing, and customizable research options that allow users to add specialized data sources. This will make the AI even more powerful and personalized for professionals in different fields. But deep research is not the only new development. OpenAI has also released a smaller scale AI model called O3 Mini. This model is designed to provide more cost-effective reasoning capabilities. Integrated into ChatGPT and API services, the O3 Mini model is particularly useful for math, science, and coding problems. OpenAI is making it available to Plus Team and Pro subscribers, with enterprise access coming soon. The free tier version of ChatGPT now also includes an optimized version of O3 Mini accessible via the Reason option in the Message Composer. So, what does all of this mean for the future of AI? OpenAI's deep research represents a major step toward artificial general intelligence. By automating complex research tasks, AI has the potential to revolutionize industries that rely on data analysis, scientific discovery, and strategic decision-making. However, this also raises concerns about over-reliance on AI-generated information. While deep research can save time, it's crucial that professionals critically evaluate its findings, as AI is still prone to hallucinations and misinformation. The battle for AI dominance is far from over. With OpenAI striking back after DeepSeek AI's rise, the competition in this space is pushing the boundaries of what AI can achieve. Deep research is just the beginning. AI is evolving at an unprecedented pace, and we are witnessing the dawn of autonomous AI systems that can fundamentally change the way we work, learn, and innovate.